here is a simple trick on how to perfect your finger drumming skills especially if you are just starting for some of us who are just coming into this aspect of djing your fingers are going to be stiff like the mechanic that has been carrying block engine for some years <laughs> especially if you have not been using the keyboard or any soft appliance before but don't worry in this video i got you covered you have nothing to worry about i'm going to give you one of the simplest way you will use to build up that flexibility of your finger as you start first make sure you get a very simple track that you are familiar with look at it in this case i have loaded a very simple track after loading the track select the tip of the song and set your hot q1 that is control one this is it, the key that does the hot cue one. I'm going to start the song with the hot cue one. You hear it? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You can see, very simple. So for us to really get this done, after you make sure your drum samples are already installed and everything is in good condition. If you need more explanation on that, check the channel. There are a host of videos I explain everything about it, how to set up these drum samples. Then the next thing you do is look at the sound. These are two different sounds, F12 and F11. If you follow my arrangement of the samples in the video I stated. So you have one, two, three, four. So just the way you count one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So the same principle. Now what we'll do is when we select one, two of two of these, we we'll select one of these. Then we'll now select one of these we'll now select this one again so that is how we'll do it let's slow with it now you see so by the time you do that after a period of time the next thing there is when you do it you allow it to run then you go with one two three four one two three four so you now see everything flows I'm, I'll go over to another track again. You, you see, I will exhibit the same principle on it again. Then you will see the same thing will happen. I'm sure at this stage you've seen how simple it is. Very simple and straightforward. One, two, three, four. One. So most of the time, most of the time, what you actually be doing as you progress is, is when the first sound start, this. By the time this one start, the next sound that should come is your. So that means when you have one of these. So you are not going to be playing it directly on the particular sound. This this means that you cannot be doing like this. Actually, that one is also another concept, but when you are just starting, make sure that the heat sound, when the heat sound hits, you skip it, then you move to the next sound. This is it. So it's going to be like this. Practice with this letter C. If you are using my mapping, you will get to appreciate it the more. By the time you do it, then if you do that, then you know. So at this stage, at this stage, you don't see how simple it is. So if you are just coming across the channel, don't forget to keep a date as I continue to bring you more. I'm sure you really derive value. You see that you become better in this. Practice, 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 practice until your fingers become very flexible, like some of us, so that you wouldn't look like somebody that is carrying hammer and breaking blocks or carrying block engine. Thank you for being once again. Let's continue to enjoy more as I bring you more. <laughs> It's your boy right here on the wheels of wheels of steel. Check this out. Check out DJ Don Genius. Check out DJ Don Genius. Check this out. Check out DJ Don Genius on all streaming platforms for more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, 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 okay.